Comet 3A Atlas. Our newest interstellar visitor has suddenly lit up in a vivid emerald hue. Astronomers first spotted the color change in early September 2025, just weeks before it makes its closest approach to the Sun on October 30th, at about 1.4 astronomical units, roughly the distance between Mars and the Sun. If you are in the Southern Hemisphere with a mid-range telescope, you might just catch it before it slips behind the Sun. But this isn't another comet show. This is the third interstellar object ever seen in human history, and it's rewriting the rules of cometary science. When astronomers first detected 3I Atlas in July 2025 using the NASA's Atlas Survey Telescope in Chile, they knew it was something special. Its speed, 58 km per second, meant it was bound to our solar system. It was just passing through. But as weeks passed, what really shocked scientists was how alive this comet was. Normally, comets only become active when they're within about 5 astronomical units of the Sun, near Jupiter's orbit, where solar heat can sublimate their icy surface. But 3I Atlas was already venting gas and dust far beyond that point. It was awake too early, a clear sign that something very strange was happening under its crust. Using the James Webb Space Telescope, scientists discovered that its surface was rich in carbon dioxide even seven times more abundant than water. That's unheard of. It suggests that the comet formed far from any other star in temperatures so cold that carbon dioxide could freeze solid, the kind of environment found beyond the icy ages of most planetary systems. The chemical fingerprints told astronomers that a 3 i atlas likely came from a distant frozen world, maybe even the shattered remains of a Pluto-like planet orbiting another star. But then came the twist that has everyone puzzled. It's sudden green glow. Usually when comets appear green, the color comes from diatomic carbon or C2, a molecule that glows emeralds when excited by sunlight. We have seen it in classic comets like Lovejoy and Neowise. But when telescopes analyze 3 i Atlas, they found something completely different. No detectable diatomic carbon at all. It's what astronomers call carbon chain depleted, lacking those long carbon molecules entirely. So in theory, this comet shouldn't be able to shine green. Yet astronomers in Namibia captured stunning images, showing a clear green coma enveloping it. So what's causing the glow? At first, some thought it might be cyanogen a compound of carbon and nitrogen often found in comets, but cyanogen emits mostly violet light, not green. So that theory doesn't hold. That means this mysterious color could be coming from an unknown compound, possibly one that doesn't exist anywhere in our solar system. Imagine that, a chemical signature literally alien to us. But the mysteries don't end here. Observations from ground-based telescopes like Gemini South and the Very Large Telescope in Chile revealed a peculiar structure, a dust plume shooting towards the sun instead of away from it. That's the opposite of what comets naturally do. This sunward jet suggests that intense localized heating is blasting carbon dioxide and dust from one hemisphere of the comet, forming a fan-shaped coma that evolves almost weakly. It's a living, breathing alien iceberg, changing shape as it stumbles through our solar system. Even stranger polarimetric studies showed that J Atlas scatters light in a way we have never seen before. A deep negative polarization branch, meaning the light waves are vibrating parallel to the sun comet line instead of perpendicular. The only other object that behaves like this are trans-Neptunian bodies like Pluto and Charon, where frost coats a dark carbon-rich crust. So could 3 Atlas be a fragment of a frozen exoplanet, a shard of a long-lost world flung into interstellar space billions of years ago? For now, we can only speculate. Tracking its path backwards, astronomers using ESA's Gaia Space Telescope found that the comet has wandered through the galaxy, undisturbed for at least 4 million years, with no close stellar encounters in that time. It's pristine, untouched since the dawn of its home system. As it races towards its perihelion, it's about to collide, not physically but energetically. 
with a major solar event, a coronal mass ejection or CME. A coronal mass ejection or CME is expected to strike it this month. When that happens, it will be like blasting a frozen time capsule from another star with the full force of the sun's magnetic fury. Scientists are eager to see what happens next, whether new materials erupt from its core or whether its green glow intensifies or fades. It's the ultimate natural experiment unfolding 400 million kilometers away. If you're hoping to spot it, here's your chance. As of early October, three atlas is visible through medium telescopes in the southern evening sky, low near the horizon before dawn. But it's fading quickly. By late October, it will disappear behind the sun and reappear in December, possibly transformed after its close solar pass. So what makes three atlas so extraordinary? It's not just that it's green. It's that it shouldn't be. It defies chemistry, it defies physics, and it defies expectations. It reminds us that the universe still holds secrets no lab on Earth can reproduce.